foodie. Do you have any foodies in? Yeah, yeah some foodies in. I like um, I love my food. I like I like, um, I like butter. Right, I'm a big fan of butter. Apparently, you can tell if someone likes butter. Do you know this? You can use a butter cup. Do you know that? You, put, you get a butter cup, right? You put it under someone's chin, right? And if they've got two chins, they definitely like butter. <laughs> you can all do it. <laughs> uh, uh, my, my parents are divorced. Uh, give me a cheer if your parents are divorced. Yay! Yay broken homes with a kid. <laughs> My parents, my parents got divorced when I was about seven, right? I was about seven years old. I think it's quite hard to explain to a seven-year-old about divorce. My mum, my mum explained it through my toys. Right? She, went, she went, he man has left She-Ra for Chitara. <laughs> Chitara is a fucking bitch. <laughs> My parents were always arguing on the stairs. Always arguing on the stairs. I couldn't have they'd still be together if we lived in a bungalow. <laughs> <laughs> they've moved on. They've moved on. My mum, my uh, she's, uh, she's got a younger boyfriend. Woo! Yeah, no, she calls him a toy boy. Um, he calls her a cougar. Uh, my dad's got a younger girlfriend. <laughs> yeah, we call him a pedo. <laughs> I think mums are rubbish with technology, aren't they? Would you admit it, mums? Yeah. Yeah. I don't believe you're slapping out there, yeah. You, 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 do, you do the emails? Yeah, yeah, she's like, what's the email? I don't know. Is that phones? <laughs> my mum the other day, my mum the other day, she goes to me, she went, Joe, Joe, I've just got an email, I've just got an email from 1956. She had an email from four minutes to eight. <laughs> She nudged the computer the other day. She, she nudged the computer, the computer came on, she screamed, right? She went, ah! I went, Mum, what's wrong? She went, the computer, it's just come on. I was like, yeah, it was asleep, and you woke it up. Right? She then whispered, she went, oh, sorry. <laughs> I did something manly, I saw a man up recently. Um, I, um, uh, I went to a boxing match. Has anyone here been to a boxing match? Yeah, yeah what do you shout at the boxers? What do you shout? Yeah, smack him, fuck him up. <laughs> Too much aggression over here. Smack him. Nice. What? What would you shout? We've got smack him, we've got... <laughs> I'd say, well, I didn't know. I didn't know whether to go, like, hit him, hit him, or kill him, kill him. Do you know what I went for? I went for, I went for, punish him! <laughs> Slap his body. Middle class people shouldn't go to boxing. There's no middle class boxers. Oh, there most boxers. I oh, know most boxers say things like oh, float like a butterfly, sting like a bee, not float like a crouton, <laughs> sting like inheritance tax. <laughs> my mate shouted something much worse. My mate shouted. My mate shouted. Fist him. <laughs> well, don't do that. Not with those gloves. <laughs> People around us going, you keep shouting like that, I'm going to fist you. <laughs> so scared. I almost dropped my hot chocolate. <laughs> I do worry about these kids. I worry about this generation of kids. Because it's the way they talk. I'm, they can't be talking like this for the rest of their lives. You can't have old people talking like the way they talk now. You can't have old people going, what's happening, bro? What's happening? <laughs> What's happening, bro? What's happening? I don't know what's happening. I don't know. Why do you not know what's happening? I've got dementia. <laughs> what are you saying? I've got hearing aids. <laughs> so um, I do like doing this job. This, this job is a, it's called. I hate the travel. We travel quite a lot. Um, I, got, I took the train, right? And I, I fucking hate taking the train. Do you know what happened to me on the train? I got on the train, right? I yawned as someone farted. <laughs> Worse. <laughs> I can still taste it. The yawn and the fart. Oh, it's not a good combination, is it? What I hate, the worst actually, I hate I hate sitting opposite the couple. Do you know that couple? I always get sat opposite this couple that are kissing, cuddling, touching, doing stuff, right? I never know what to do. I think I know what to do now. I'm thinking, I'm thinking, they make me feel awkward. I'm gonna make them feel awkward. So I just get out of the camera. <laughs> 
touch myself. <laughs> <laughs> actually, the, actually, the worst thing that's ever happened to me on a train. Someone fell asleep on my shoulder on the train the other day. I didn't even know this guy's head was there. And I'm like, mate, fuck off. He wouldn't move. Then his head fell in my lap. So, like, mate, you're gonna have to move. So I'm sort of slapping him and slapping him. He's not moving. Then, then I had to, I had to thrust. Right? Thrust in, thrust in. He wasn't moving. I looked up. Everyone was looking at me. <laughs> So I just stopped and I went, he's, uh, he's asleep. And then he piped up and just went, I'm not. <laughs> so I, I should, well, I'm staying in this hotel. It's, it's all right. I, I don't mind hotels. I don't mind. Although I messed up in this hotel. I, I messed up in this hotel, right? They, they, they had a breakfast machine in the hotel. Does anyone, do you know what I'm talking about? Do you, know, you know the breakfast machines? Do you know the ones where you put bread in? Right? You put bread in it, right? It goes down a little conveyor belt, right? And it comes out toast. Like magic. Do you know the ones? It's not a toaster, mate. It's not. What's it fucking? What is it called? It's not a toaster. No, that's a fucking toaster. It goes like that. What is it? A bread warmer. It doesn't fucking toast it, does it? No, thank you. But anyway, we'll have a chat about it later. You're wrong. Um, you know the words, it goes down a conveyor belt, comes out toast. I thought I could do that, right, with a croissant. <laughs> you can't do it with a croissant, can you? I put a croissant in, it came out on fire. <laughs> I, I said the poshest thing I think I've ever said. I went, I went, I went, my croissant is ablaze. <laughs> I tried to put it out with a latte. <laughs> It's steaming, it's black, this posh woman walked past and I just went, oh, sorry, the toilets were occupied. Ladies <laughs> <laughs> uh, and gentlemen, you've been, really, you've been so much fun, you've got a fabulous head like Max. Uh, thank you very much. We love you. Thank you. Bye.